they saw Rob Marshall just walking around with what appeared to be a head wound. His wife, Maria, was lying across the front seat of their 1980 Cadillac Eldorado, dead. So when police arrived, Rob told them that they had been traveling back from Atlantic City. When he felt that one of the rear tires was starting to feel a little funny, he felt it might be going a little flat. So he pulled off the parkway into this Oyster Creek picnic area. Now, Maddie, I'm going to describe this area to you. So when you pull off, it's not like you're just pulling off a little offshoot of the highway there where you can still see the cars. You have to go a ways off the road. There are no lights and it's heavily wooded. So you can't even see the parkway from the picnic area. And an entry sign says it closes at dusk. Hmm. If you're keeping track, that's a... (laughs) <laughs> Why would you do that? It might be a question you ask. So when police arrived, police check Maria, and of course there is no pulse. So Rob had told the police that while he was bending down to look at the tire, he had heard another car enter the picnic area.